do whatever you need. Move to the beat, move, move to the beat. Move to the beat, to the move 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 to the Hey guys. Whew. Okay, y'all. So prayerfully, we don't have any chair breaks today. Yeah, I sat very gently in the chair. <laughs> very gently in the chair because it's the only chair I got and if this will break I'm done well I'm not done I'm just gonna have to go back to my hot top chair but we are back with another video and I had to rearrange some stuff because I kept seeing it on my timeline I kept seeing it on YouTube I kept seeing it on TikTok and I said I have to review this battle because I don't want to see it until I review it I want to stop seeing it until I review it so we here we are 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 here but if you are new here welcome back my name is coach kia and welcome to the unlock your dance family i am a travel major at hbcu dance coach choreographer and trainer outside of major at hbcu i also train in jazz ballet contemporary tap a lot of stuff okay <laughs> a lot of stuff if you are already a part of the Unlock Your Dance fam, grab your PJs, grab you a little drink. This is not alcoholic guys, calm down. Grab you a little drink and let's get this party started because I got somewhere to be in a little bit and I ain't got all time to talk. We need to get into this, get into this reaction, get into this battle. Not too much on the PJs, honey. I don't know if it's the bra. I don't know what's going on, but they is, woo. Yeah, they trying to pop out the scene. They just trying to pop out the scene. This is another pair of PJs that I got from my bridesmaid. It's a bride on the back, but I don't feel like getting up and all that because I might hit the camera. So if you don't know how we start every video, we start with our SOTV, our scripture of the video where I choose one scripture out of my scripture box. And we have a little chit chat on what it means and how we can relate it to our everyday life. I want this one because it's all balled up. Yep. This is the one I want right here. Right here, right here, right here. I'm about to say, did we do this one? We did. Okay, so we have 1 Peter 5, 5 and 6. You that are younger, submit yourselves unto the elder. Everyone, clothe yourselves with humility to one another because God resists the proud but give grace to the humble. And on the back, I have humble yourself under God so he may exalt and lift you up in due time this is a great one this is a great one this is a great one you that are younger submit yourselves unto the elder so of course we as um when you are younger you always understand that uh or you are always told be kind to your elders respect your elders honor your elders you know whatever that means to you or how you grew up and i still believe in that today as long as your elders i look at it both ways i mean i i'm, I'm always one for respect me and i'll respect you back but even if you don't respect me that does that still does not give me the, re the right to just cuss you out and all of that stuff i can still show you respect even though you don't respect me that just shows me that the boundary and the line that we have to have we can spread apart so even when it comes to coaching um dancers respect your coach coaches respect your dancers no matter what the age different it, difference is but also remind yourselves that um no matter how you are treated you still respect people how you want to be treated so let's say that you are in a um, studio or in an environment where your coach that is older than you becomes disrespectful in their coaching and they may call it tough love but it's a difference to have tough love and be hard on your dancers and then and then to another extent be disrespectful call oof, be disrespectful and calling your dancers name so of course that difference once you cross that line then you as a dancer or you as a parent snatch your child about it at or even um college if you're on a college team your coach your captain becomes disrespectful that is right for you to say you know what either speak up and then if it doesn't change go ahead and step down or step away and say you know what i don't want to be a part of an organization team or whatever that is going to disrespect me no matter my age um and then the second one or the second part everyone clothe yourself with humility to one another because god resists the proud and give grace to the humble so proud aka pride we are we already know what pride means pride means pride can mean being um 
I did it this way so I don't need God to help me do it another way or I was able to get on a dance team by doing all of this by myself so I don't need training I don't need help from a coach I don't need help from a former member I was able to do this on my own so I can open this dance studio on my own without any help that is pride versus um you can have another side of pride which is the poverty side of pride or I call it, I call it poverty because I think of it as a poverty mindset where you feel like I need $20 but my pride is I have so much pride and I'm not going to ask nobody for $20. I'm going to just figure it out. I need a ride somewhere but because of my pride I'm not going to ask for a ride. I'm going to just walk for two, three hours whatever here god tells us that clothe yourself in humility humility means being humble humility means um knowing when to ask humility means being okay with asking humility means being okay with giving humility means be knowing that you are not better than anybody humility means knowing that you are not greater than anybody when it comes to dance you may let's let's be honest you may be the da best dancer in the room but that does not mean that you should disrespect or talk to your um your Talk to other dancers as they are less than. Talk to your coach as she is less than, even as the coach. Yes, you are the coach over um, a team, but at the end of the day, we're all human. So you should still be humble in the way that you talk to your dancers, in the way that you talk to your parents, etc., and not um, be pride prideful. So always remember, especially that last part, that clothe yourself with humility to one another because God resists the proud and give grace to the humble. I don't know about you, but I don't want God to resist me. I, I got too much, too much. Not even I got too much. It's just too much in this world to live in a world where God resists you. Like literally me sitting here right now in this house recording this video is um, proof that God doesn't resist me. He could easily struck me down right now. He could easily let this house catch on fire. He could easily have a missile from Russia come straight down. Like, I know I'm saying like crazy, exaggerated. He could have somebody bust into my door and try to rob me and my family. Like, you you do, you do, never want to live in a state where you feel like you don't need God or you never want to live in a state or you never want to live in a prideful state that causes God to resist you. So always stay humble in whatever that is, whether that's dance, coaching, teaching, your everyday life, always stay in a humble state because it tells us right here, God resists the proud. Now, I don't know about you, but I don't need God to resist me. I need all the zisting, <laughs> not the re, I need all the zisting. <laughs> I can't get it. That's what I need, but let's go ahead and get into this video i hope that helps somebody today y'all know what time it is get your pajamas popcorn if you need it i'm gonna get comfy and sit on back um i really don't know what we're about to watch guys because i've seen i've seen a few videos so i think we are going to start with um the battle between the regulators and the elite gems because there's so many other battles that i want to see as well too so we have officially entered our summer band um uh, battles so these are like um bands that have dancers from all aspects walks of life so adult dancer well i think everybody adults but we have some dancers from previous HBCUs, dancers from PWIs, dancers from just the community. So we have a mixture of dancers um, from all over. So I'm excited. I'm excited. So we are going to start with the regulators and just the elite gems by the thumbnail smash time. It look like it's going to get juicy. I ain't got no juice. I got a little Dr. Pepper, but we finna see. All right. Y'all ready? I ain't ready. I ain't going to even lie. Let's get into it. Uniform is T. I did see their pictures. I love that they have guys. I don't think, did they have guys last year? I don't remember seeing guys last year. Mm, mm. Come on, Stan. Love the hair, too. Ooh, we is getting it, y'all. 
y'all face and I love it. Ooh, I love it. I love it. Period. She said I'm gonna be gentle this time. Oh, she said I'm gonna move my chair over. It's so ratchet. I love it. I love how ratchet this is already. Already. I love how disrespectful we're being. After we just talked about being respectful. <laughs> we just talked about being respectful. And we're being disrespectful already. Okay, Jim. Oh, smash time my eyes. Where is the stabilizer? We need the stabilizer for this camera. Uh-oh. Oh, they walk around. Okay. I ain't gonna lie. You would think dancing in grass is easier. I don't know. I don't know. This uniform is cute though, I ain't gonna lie. This is cute. Maybe it's the song, but I'm honestly... <coughs> it could be the song, it could be the angle, it could be... I, I don't know, I'm not a fan right now, I'm not so... <laughs> we is fighting. Is she chewing gum for real? Or that's just, I know you're not chewing gum. 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 I'm sorry. I love that this count starts from the back. That is so cute. Yeah. 
Yes, ma'am. Was she? I think she was on team last year. <coughs> Oh, they don't face them. I love these. These are these are what you call battle counts, and I love it. I love. I feel like their counts are battle counts, but not too much. You get what I'm saying? But let's keep watching. Let's keep watching. Like, these are counts that I would see. I, I feel like we would see, like, at an actual game. That is T. That is T. Y'all know I love a good angle count. Give me angles. guys 
said they beating your behind. Ooh, ooh, we whooping your behind. That's the difference though. I think, I'm not going to lie, I feel like regulators, regulators should have let them dance. Regulators should have let them dance. Regulators should have let them dance. Only reason is, is because at the end of the day, it's about dance. At the end of the day, it's about dance. At the end of the day, it's about dance. The babies is hot. <coughs> the babies is hot. Now y'all can't be mad if they start <coughs> if they start dancing on y'all music. Cause y'all was dancing on theirs. Is it like, is it, is it any other beef? Cause it clearly looks like it's a lot of trash talking going on too. So was, was there any trash talking going on before this battle? Like, y'all let me know. Keep me up to date. Keep me up to date in the comments. Because clearly this is, this is more than dance. The way the way that the way that they're dancing and getting in each other's face, you can tell that this has more to do. More, more, more. I can't even get it out. It's some beef. It's some underlying beef. I kind of like how she came through that crack. What? 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 That's it. I ain't gonna lie, that stand is key for a battle. I might have to use that for a stand battle.
I think another thing is too is they are not as together as the regulators. What you gonna do, girl? This gum is still in her mouth. But I'm still gonna give her the benefit of the doubt and say that she's chewing on her tongue. Oh, this is too much. This is a lot. This is a lot. I was not expecting this. I was, but I wasn't. I like. I can't. I can't be. I'm just going to say my thoughts to the end because this is a lot. That cow is so cute. say guys we have another battle um, of the same groups the regulators the elite gyms and another team called GTA so I don't know if GTA left and said they didn't want to be a part of of the beef I don't know I don't know I don't know but what I do know is we will probably have to do another review <laughs> because that was a lot I feel like that was just all over the place I couldn't really give like my honest opinion but I mean from watching it from what we could see I feel like the regulators count they were a little bit more together on their counts of course I'm just speaking solely off of what we just saw so from what we just saw is it seems like the regulators started it because they started dancing during the elite gym song so which of course the elite gyms were going to dance to their song and then you know getting in each other's face and everything like that so my thing is i'm always for i'm always for let's have a good battle i am always for let's have a good battle but i'm also always for turn that anger into dance so whatever y'all mad about whatever the beef is whoever talked about whoever mama can't dance and all of that show me in your dancing and I don't feel like I was able to really see that because everybody was in each other's faces. Everybody was, you know, you had the audience trying to block it and all of that. So we weren't really able to see just the dancing. Um, so like I said, there there is another video. Because I know Trend has some videos as well too of them. That's interesting guys. Let me know your thoughts in the comments. This is definitely going to be like a little quick one too. Because like I said, I wasn't expecting it. I was not expecting that so so yeah that's how I feel that's how I feel about it I am very curious to know how y'all feel in the comments and if you were there if you were there at the battle please let me know please let me know how it felt in person because I know it's probably crazy in person but yeah y'all that's all I got <laughs> that's all I got for today's video we will we will dig a little deeper we will dig a little deeper we will dig a little deeper but remember guys be humble be humble be humble because god resists the proud okay 
I feel like today's scripture was perfect for today's video. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. But other than that, make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see y'all in the next video. Bye.